Tyndarius, a powerful Spartan king, was known for his political shrewdness. He had a beautiful daughter named Helen, who was desired by many suitors. Tyndarius was concerned that whoever he chose to marry Helen would start a war for her hand in marriage. So, he came up with an ingenious plan. He made all the suitors swear to support and defend Helen's husband, no matter who he would be. This made Helen the most sought-after bride in all of Greece. However, Tyndarius faced another challenge in his family. His wife, Leda, was seduced by Zeus in the form of a swan and gave birth to two sets of twins. One set was Helen and Clytemnestra, who were both mortal, while the other set was Castor and Pollux, who were immortal and became gods. This unconventional family setup led to many controversies, but Tyndarius tried his best to maintain peace and keep his family together. Despite his efforts, Tyndarius was unable to avoid the tragedy that came with the Trojan War. Agamemnon, his son-in-law and husband of Clytemnestra, led the Greeks to war against Troy to bring back Helen when she was abducted by Paris. The Trojan War brought about the deaths of many soldiers and heroes, and led to the ultimate downfall of Agamemnon and his family. In the end, Tyndarius was remembered as a wise and shrewd king who tried to navigate his family and his kingdom through the treacherous world of Greek mythology. Do you want to explore more Greek mythology stories? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.